three years back, the occupants of Yellowstone National Park asserted one of their rights as Wyoming natives, state-supported trainings for their kids. Presently, the territory of Wyoming needs to guarantee the individuals who live and work in Yellowstone satisfy one commitment of being a Wyoming occupant, enrolling their vehicles in the state. At the demand of Governor Matt Mead and individuals from Wyoming's congressional assignment, and evidently impelled by grumblings from a Cody occupant, the Wyoming Department of Transportation is pushing to get more Yellowstone inhabitants and specialists to take after state law and buy Wyoming enlistments and driver's licenses. There are around 550 perpetual and more than 3,000 occasional representatives working for the National Park Service and Yellowstone's concessionaire. Zantara Parks and Resorts. State and government authorities say they don't know what number of those individuals need to get Wyoming plates, at the same time, with a normal vehicle enrollment costing several hundred dollars, the state could hypothetically be missing out on a huge number of dollars in charges every year. Bill Panos, YDOT's executive, says it's been an issue for a considerable length of time and a long time. The U.S. government trucks would one say one are thing, however the private vehicles that are up there constantly, and the Zantara vehicles? I need to see Wyoming plates on those trucks, Panos revealed to Park County Chiefs in August. Also, that will happen. Why? joined by the Park County Treasurer's Office, has talked with Yellowstone and Zantara authorities about the issue this year. We really found that there were various individuals, not the same number of as individuals thought, but rather there were various individuals, that were changeless occupants up there that didn't have Wyoming enrollments and didn't have Wyoming driver's licenses, Panos said. YDOT intends to influence a push to build the quantity of enrollments when a permanent workers to begin touching base in the recreation center next spring. Yellowstone Superintendent Dan Wink says he feels that, among the recreation center's year-round occupants, there's an exceptionally abnormal state of consistency with Wyoming's vehicle enrollment laws. In a Tuesday talk with, Wink likewise speculated that there's significantly less consistency among occasional representatives, saying vehicle enrollments are not something a laborer would typically consider amid their months in Yellowstone. I would recommend that that is additionally valid in any buddy farm outside of the recreation center, any business in Cody or Powell or wherever else as far as those sorts of occasional representatives, Wink said. I don't believe we're any unique in relation to any other person in such manner. Be that as it may, the director likewise said he trusts the recreation center has an obligation to make Yellowstone and concession air representatives mindful of Wyoming's laws. We have educated individuals concerning enrollment, previously, yet we concurred we could accomplish more, Wink said of the talks this year. While the Park Service has included enlistment data in its own worker handbook, Wink said he concluded that we could converse with Zantara about what the duties were, that they ought to tell their representatives of the prerequisites. Panos told magistrates in August that a great deal of Zantara's trucks require Wyoming plates. A representative for Zantara, Rick Honing Ozn, alluded inquiries to YDOT. It would be troublesome for us to remark, since we are as yet anticipating further direction and illumination with respect to who this may affect and what particularly would be required, he said. It wasn't helpful. A portion of the Park County authorities and occupants who helped push the enlistment issue to the bleeding edge were bothered by the way that Wink needed Wyoming plates without anyone else's individual vehicle. The issue is the point at which your director up there is enlisting his stuff out of state, Park County Sheriff Scott Stewart said at a September 5 meeting among the district's chosen authorities, saying when that is the situation, what are the troops going to do? Province officials sent Wink a letter in December 2016, requesting that he get inhabitants and representatives to follow the state's enrollment laws. Wink's staff consulted with the Department of the Interior's Provincial Office of the Solicitor, which affirmed Wyoming's vehicle laws apply in Yellowstone. Appropriately, I will ready all stop occupants and inhabitant representatives of the relevance of the statutes, Wink said in a March reaction to the area, including, huge numbers of them will have conditions they should clear up without anyone else about whether the statutes apply to them. 
No less than one region chief raised the subject with Wenk when the director went by Cody in May. At the point when chiefs met with him in Yellowstone on the evening of September 5, Wenk Staggs were raised once more. That time, he reached the Park County Treasurer's office and exchanged his vehicle's enlistment from South Dakota to Wyoming. Inquired as to why he didn't do the switch prior, I have no reason other than it wasn't advantageous, Wenk said. Also, I could have done it via mail, and I at long last did it via mail. However, he likewise fights that the legitimate circumstance isn't obvious, to some extent since Wyoming's law struggle with other states' laws, by exchanging his vehicle's enrollment, he lost his lawful status as a South Dakotan, residency he set up in 1985 and had kept up even while beforehand living in Washington, D.C. Since I was causing this hullabaloo, I enlisted my vehicle in Wyoming. In any case, my significant other, who spends not as much as a large portion of a year here, and she has an auto, where am I expected to enlist that auto? Wenk asked logically, including, my house is in South Dakota, and in the event that I enroll her vehicle here, she's never again an occupant of South Dakota, either. Yellowstone Chief Ranger Peter Webster said it's not a basic issue for law authorization. Webster said there's uncertainty and unpredictability, in light of the fact that the enlistment frequently relies upon a man's individual circumstance, it isn't no matter how you look at it that everyone, high contrast, that has a Yellowstone National Park representative sticker ought to likewise have a Wyoming tag, Webster said. He gave the case of Yellowstone representatives who just live and work in Montana, for example, those at the West and North Passageways. Wenk additionally gave the hypothetical case of two companions from Colorado who take summer occupations in the recreation center between semesters at, separately, the University of Wyoming and a school in Washington. In that case, the UW understudy would not need to re-enlist his Colorado auto in Wyoming, and state understudies are exempted, however the laborer going to class in Washington would. The Recreation Center's Worker Handbook conveys an advisement that Wyoming law expects individuals to enlist their vehicles when they progress toward becoming occupants of the state. It characterizes that as living in Wyoming and owning, leasing or renting a living arrangement. Stop County authorities have said the vehicle enrollment law likewise applies when you enlist to vote in Wyoming or have lived here for 120 days, paying little minds to where you call home. A battle about school subsidizing. Vehicle enlistments in Yellowstone turned into a point of convergence in view of a current disagreement about who needs to pay for the training of the around three dozen kids living in Mammoth Hot Springs, the Recreation Center's managerial center point. For a considerable length of time, the national government had took care of everything for the understudies to be instructed in Gardner, Montana. In any case, in 2014, Yellowstone authorities reported they'd revealed an old law that restricted the national government from paying for the understudies' training. Mammoth inhabitants at that point swung to the territory of Wyoming for subsidizing. As Wyoming occupants, they presented a request of to Park County authorities with 108 marks. It solicited that the northern part from Yellowstone, which exists in Park County, be added to one of the nearby school locale. At the encouraging of Gov. Mead and others, the Park County District Boundary Board, made up of the region officials, assessor and treasurer, reluctantly consented to make the zone a piece of the PAL school area. The province of Wyoming hopes to pay around $430,000 for the Mammoth Understudies training this year in Gardner. While there have been no calculated issues with the plan, a few limit board authorities and individuals from general society stay miserable with how things played out. I'm still continually getting messages, Park County Assessor Pat Meyer said at the province's September 5 meeting, he called the National Park Service's activities not reasonable. Our state lawmakers, I've conversed with many of them over it, and they concur that we ought not subsidize these children to head toward Gardner, Montana. Yellowstone stop ought to pay that bill, Meyer said. Between the absence of vehicle enlistments and the way that Yellowstone's cabins and other concession air offices are not subject to property charges, we're passing up a great opportunity for some enormous cash for charges, Meyer said. 
the national government gives the region payments in lieu of taxes, about $1.84 million in the last financial year, for its approximately 3.59 million sections of land of elected grounds. Wyoming Fuel, Hotel and Deals charges are evaluated in Yellowstone. Wink says that adds up to around $10 million a year, which all goes to ventures outside the recreation center. Financing from vehicle enrollments are appropriated similarly as property charges, K-12 schools get 72% of the subsidizing, the district gets 12%, and different other administrative elements split the rest of the 16%, said Park County Treasurer Barb Poli. Fault Finder begins discussion. Cody inhabitant Steve Torrey, an untamed life picture taker and FR, 